Hi again. So this is the second video for today. The previous video was about how to repair a dead laptop motherboard. Now we gonna discuss the basics of Avalanche photodiodes because some of my followers ask me to explain the Avalanche photodiodes. So that's why I have here an article in my website as you can see here this is of course my website that you can check anytime you will find the link in the description box for this article and also for, for my website so let's get started this is a very important article that will guide you through the basics of avalanche photodiodes understanding how they work so let's get started so this is basically how it looks like as you can see so avalanche breakdown avalanche breakdown is a phenomenon that occurs in certain types of semiconductors such as avalanche photodiodes APD. It plays a crucial role in the operation of these devices, allowing them to detect and amplify low light signals. Understanding the basics of avalanche breakdown is essential for grasping how APD works. So, when a reverse bias voltage is applied to a semiconductor such as silicon or germanium, it creates a region within the device called the depletion region. This region is depleted to charge carriers, making it similar to a small capacitor with no charge. As the reverse bias voltage increases, the electric field within the depletion region also increases. At a certain crucial voltage, known as a breakdown voltage or avalanche voltage, the electric field becomes strong enough to generate electron hole pairs through a process called impact ionization. These electron hole pairs, known as carriers, are then accelerated by the electric field and create additional electron hole pair through further collisions. As the process continues, it results in an avalanche of electron hole pairs, leading to a rapid increase in the number of charge carriers within the depletion region. This phenomenon is known as avalanche breakdown. In the case of APDs, the avalanche breakdown is deliberately initiated and controlled to achieve desired device performance. Semiconductor devices. Avalanche photodiodes are specialized semiconductor devices that utilize the phenomenon of avalanche breakdown to detect and amplify optical signals. To understand how APDs work, it is important to have a basic understanding of semiconductor devices in general. Semiconductor devices are made from materials that have properties between those of conductors such as metals and insulators, such as ceramics. These materials, typically silicon or germanium, so basically here we have the silicon or germanium, so have a specific band gap energy that determines their electrical behavior. When a voltage is applied to a semiconductor device, it can either be in forward bias or reverse bias. In a forward bias, the voltage is applied in a direction that allows the flow of current through the device. In a reverse bias, the voltage is applied in the opposite direction, which effectively blocks the flow of current.
One of the essential characteristics of semiconductor devices is their ability to control the flow of current by manipulating the voltage. This property makes them ideal for various applications, including electronics, solar cells, and optoelectronic devices like APGs, working principle of avalanche photodiodes. Avalanche photodiodes APDs are specifically designed to operate in the avalanche breakdown <coughs> region to achieve high sensitivity and low noise performance. They are commonly used in applications that require high speed and low light detection, such as medical imaging, telecommunications, and scientific research. The working principle of an APD is relatively straightforward when an optical signal such as photon interacts with the semiconductor material within, within the APD, it creates electron hole pairs. These electron hole, hole pairs are then accelerated by the applied reverse bias voltage. And if the electric field is high enough, they can gain sufficient kinetic energy to cause impact ionization and initiate avalanche breakdown. Once avalanche breakdown occurs, the original electron hole pairs amplify to form a large number of charge carriers within the depletion region. This amplification process is known as avalanche multiplication and is the key to the highest sensitivity of APDs. The amplified charge carriers are collected and measured as an output current or voltage that corresponds to the incident optical signal. The increased number of charge carriers result in a higher signal to noise ratio, allowing APDs to detect weak optical signals that would be otherwise undetectable by standard photodiodes. So now we're gonna see the benefits of avalanche photodiodes. Avalanche photodiodes offer several advantages compared to other photo detector technologies, making them highly desirable for various applications. So the first benefit is high sensitivity. APDs provide a significantly higher sensitivity compared to standard photodiodes. The avalanche multiplication process allows them to detect very weak optical signal, making them ideal for applications where low light detection is critical. Low noise due to the avalanche multiplication process, APDs offer low noise performance, which is essential for maintaining signal integrity in high-speed communication systems and other sensitive applications. So the fast response time, APDs can achieve a high-speed detection and response times, making them suitable for applications applications that require rapid signal processing such as optical communication systems and scientific instrumentation. Then we have in number four, weighed spectral range. EPDs are available in various materials and design, enabling them to operate across a wide range of wavelengths. This versatility makes them suitable for diverse applications, including visible light detection, ultraviolet sensing, and infrared communication. The last benefit here, compact size. APDs can be designed to be compact and lightweight, allowing for easy integration into systems that have space constraints or require portability. So now we're gonna see the applications of avalanche photodiodes. 
So Avalanche photodiodes APDs find applications in various fields, leveraging their unique capabilities and performance characteristics. Some of the key applications of APDs include optical communication. Okay. So then leader systems. And we have here medical imaging defense and security, scientific research, and industrial and environmental and environmental monitoring. So let's begin with the first application. As you can see here, we have optical communication. APDs are widely used in long-distance optical communication systems, including fiber optic networks. Their high sensitivity and low noise performance enable them to receive and amplify weak optical signals, ensuring reliable data transmission over extended distance. So, LIDAR systems, LIDAR light detection and ranging system use laser beams to measure distance and create precise 3D maps. APDs are crucial components in leader receivers as they enable accurate detection of reflected large lights, even in low light conditions. So, third, medical imaging. APDs are utilized in various medical imaging applications such as positron emissions, tomography, scanners and single photon emission computed tomography systems their high sensitivity allows for improved image quality and reduced radiation doses for patient so defense and security apds are employed in military and security systems for applications such as target tracking laser range finding and night vision their ability to detect low light signal makes them valuable in environments where visibility is limited also used in scientific research apds play a vital role in scientific research with low light detection is often necessary. They are used in various fields including astronomy, quantum optics and practical physics experiments to detect and amplify signals originating from distant or faint sources. Finally, industrial and environmental monitoring. APDs are utilized in industrial and environmental monitoring systems for tasks such as gas sensing, environmental analysis, and remote sensing. Their high sensitivity allows for precise and reliable detection of target substances or environmental parameters. Finally, for a conclusion. Of course, feel free to check the article below in the description box. Conclusion Avalanche photodiodes are advanced semiconductor devices that utilize the phenomenon of avalanche breakdown to achieve a high sensitivity and low noise performance. Understanding the basics of avalanche breakdown and how the work is crucial for anyone interested in photo detector technologies and their applications. APDs offer distinct advantages in terms of sensitivity, noise performance, response time, spectral range, and size, making them suitable for a wide range of applications, including optical communications, medical images, defense, scientific researches, and industrial monitoring. As technology continues to advance, APDs are likely to play an increasingly significant role in enabling new and improved photon detection capabilities, further expanding their applications and impact across various industries. So that's it guys, so please don't forget to subscribe, share the video and likes because your likes motivate me to create more and more videos for you and of course for anyone who want to join me 
you can join me in my Patreon page where I share a very useful and exclusive content. I share schematics for free. You can download any schematic you want for free. You can ask me if you have any problem. You are very welcome. Guys, thank you very much and see you in the next video. And of course, you will find the link for this article in the description box and other useful links. Thank you very much.